This is a consumer alert about Allstate Insurance Company. On February 27th, I purchased motorcycle insurance. Allstate, if you go to their website, says that you can purchase new motorcycle replacement insurance, which I did. If you look at my coverage here under new motorcycle expanded protection, um, that's the coverage that if something happens, um, your motorcycle gets stolen, they give you the money to get a new one, a replacement. That's what the website says. That's what the Allstate agent told me. That's what I was led to believe. Then after I got my insurance on February 27th, on March 12th, I received a letter from Allstate stating that they made a change to my policy. And when I look at the numbers, um, they mostly look the same and that new motorcycle expanded protection coverage is still there. And then for policy documents, they put these numbers there. AU 10775, AU 14393 1, AU 14260. And that's all they give you. And it doesn't say what changes were made to the policy. That's the whole letter. So, um, in my case, well, before I move forward, according to common law, and policy section of common law. Policy has to be um, obvious, uh, openly disclosed, and easy to understand. That means that if they made a change to any policy in the packet, they have to give you the letters, the words, telling you what was changed, not just the number. In my case, they just gave me that AU whatever number. So I had my insurance for eight months. Then my motorcycle got stolen violently. And I contacted the insurance after the police. And at that point, this guy let me know that that new motorcycle replacement insurance I had paid money for um, no longer applied to theft. Now, if you go to the Allstate website and look, it clearly says that you can get a new motorcycle if it gets stolen. So then I paid for new motorcycle replacement, told it was going to cover theft, paid for one year of insurance. The motorcycle gets stolen. Oh, but before the motorcycle gets stolen, Allstate sends me a letter saying they made changes to my policy, but didn't disclose what those were. And now I got an email, and here's that policy. Look, it's that AU14260. And look, there's a lot of words to go with that. None of that was in that letter that said they changed the policy. And if you look at the replacement provision paragraph there on the bottom right of the document, um, the last sentence says, this replacement provision does not apply to loss caused by fire, theft, larceny, or, fl or flood. So basically, um, the reason I got the insurance and paid extra money for it, um, they rewrote the policy and excluded that. And now they're telling me they're not going to give me full value replacement on my motorcycle. They're only giving me a portion of my motorcycle. I live on Social Security. I have no money. And so I'm going to get a fraction of the value of my motorcycle. And I have no way of getting another one. So if you have Allstate and you think you have some coverage that sounds real good, that's advertised on their website, like a new car or motorcycle replacement thing, um, go back and look through your paperwork. And if you don't have something, make Allstate explain it to you and send you something. And you may be surprised that you paid for something believing you had a certain coverage and Allstate, after they take your money, alters your policy to not include that coverage anymore.
So I think I needed to make this video and put the word out to the general public. I'm in Florida. I've already talked to the insurance commissioner of Florida. They're going to look into the matter. But since Allstate is a company that's in all 50 states of this nation, I'm pretty sure this scam that they pulled on me is something that's going on in the entire nation. So everybody double check your Allstate insurance if you have it. And if you are considering Allstate, I strongly recommend you reconsider that decision because um, in this case, it seems that I took the hook and I fell for the bait and switch and they promised something that sounded real good. I paid for it and then they denied it after the motorcycle was stolen. And so now it's time to trash talk Allstate all over the internet. <laughs>